Well, I'm at the beach again today and got my first uh, ring find and it's not going to be gold because it came in way too high so it's going to be a junker but that's a good sign it's right on the surface so it's definitely a fresh drop well I believe I just got a tow ring that's what it looks like it is because it's really small hopefully you can hear me my camera's been in the water but it sounded good it looks kind of good but then again it doesn't so you see if that says anything in there? I think it's a tow ring. Let's put, it's all sanded in here. It's sounded good, but it just doesn't have the right look. What? Yeah, I don't know. I'll scratch test it to make sure. But, yeah, I think it's junk. Alright. This one was kind of deep. I heard my threshold break with a little bit of a rope, rope, rope. So I kept digging, digging. Sound kept getting better and better. And I just pulled this out. And it was sitting under there. I took it out and looked at it real quick. Set it on top here. And I think there's some markings in it. So we'll have a lumpy look at it. <clears throat> my threshold was breaking and I heard a little bit of a rope 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 and then I kept digging digging this thing was like about a foot down <clears throat> that thing looks really good thought I saw some marks in there It says 10K and then C. 10KC? Yeah. 10 carat, that's all I want to hear. <laughs> nice. That thing was deep. I almost missed it. I heard my threshold like cr cr it was cracking. That's a big bitch. Yeah, that's a, <laughs> that's a humongous ring. <laughs> nice. Nice. Good job. Well, I just got a gold earring, and I know it's gold because I can kind of see the marking in it. It looks like it's got a little stone in there. But I'm not going to fumble with it now, but uh, I'll show you at the end. So that's gold number two. Well, hopefully you guys can see that. There's a gold hoop earring. I thought I picked it up a little bit. I thought I can see some uh, numbers in there, but not 100%, but hopefully that's the real deal. Sure did sound beautiful. <clears throat> so hopefully that's going to be the real deal, real gold there. So I'll show you at the end. Well, Lumpy said she's got a gold. She said ring, right? Oh, that's a class ring. Yeah, it's from this year. Does it got a date and a name in it? I think so. It's from 2023. Yeah, I might be able to return it. I don't know. We'll see. Check it out. At the end. Nice. It does Wish have a name in it. It does? Yeah. That'd be a good return video then. Yeah, I don't look some yeah, Chicago. Yeah, it is in there. Unlike some Chicago dickheads, we actually return the rings that we find. <clears throat> Not gonna say it out loud. No. no. We'll look it up. It's a cute little heart. Yeah, that's nice. Mm -hmm. Alright, where'd you get it? In a shallow area? No. I got the uh, hoop earring, I think it's gold. See if you can see anything on that. That's fake as fuck. Oh, it ain't. Yes, it is. <laughs> it's Walmart finest. Yeah, that's not real, dear. I'm sorry. I thought Can I you saw tell like it's silver? No, it's shit. Keep praying. Yeah. It's already starting to pet in the joint. 
You don't see nothing? It's fake. You can tell by the clasp. Alright, whatever. <laughs> that would have been great though. It sounded fucking beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> Fresh drop. Okay, I just got back from the beach. Uh, it's been kind of a long drive back. Traffic was really bad, but anyway, um, got everything laid out here on the table, and I'll show you. Okay, uh, a lot of stuff I don't like filming, especially when there's a bunch of people around, but um, I got some junk bracelets here. Somebody actually wore the shit out of this. You can see the other side of it's all, all copper. So that must have turned their neck green. Some kind of junk bracelet here, another piece of one. Um, you know, just some junk earrings. Stainless steel cross here. Uh, this earring is junk. Somebody's key. Uh, this I didn't film. It's not silver or nothing. It's just... Um, I don't know what the hell type of metal is, but it's definitely not silver. It's a junk ring. Uh, I'm pretty sure I filmed this. Junk ring. And this thing, I'm not even going to bother acid testing it. I can tell by the looks of it. It's not real. It did sound good, though. And for the good stuff, I did get a uh, 10K. 10 karat gold ring. It's kind of a mixture of white gold and uh, yellow gold. Obviously that stone up there is fake. Might be real diamond chips around it though. I don't have a diamond tester but I can tell you that that stone's definitely fake. But it is stamped in their 10k. I'll try to get a macro pick of it. And I did get a 14 karat gold earring. It's stamped in their 14k as well. And, unfortunately, these stones are going to be fake. The one side's even missing. But, yeah, you can definitely tell those are fake. And here's Lumpy's finds. She's uh, busy right now doing something, so she can't make the wrap up. But, she found this class ring here. Um, there is a name in it. Where she was having trouble finding. She's going to try to look this up. So we don't know if that's a high school or a university. We couldn't find one in Illinois. She tried looking it up on the way home, on the ride home. So if any of you guys out there might have heard of that school or know where it's at, feel free to let us know. But there is a full name in there, but unfortunately the full name is real common. I'm not going to show you once again what the name is, but it's a common name, so we kind of got to locate this school here so we can go through the yearbook. That's the uh, symbol right there. So hopefully somebody out that's watching might know, but I think that's stamp 14K. And she found a tungsten ring, one of them spinners. And we both got a lot of change. Um, I got a lot of change in the bag here. I didn't feel like pulling it all out, but it's in there. And every time we go to a beach, you know, we beach hop. Each beach, I throw my garbage away, but the last one we didn't. There wasn't a whole lot of targets there, but this gives you an idea of what I dig. Foil and everything pieces of can slaw but you gotta dig that stuff and dig all them low tones to find this stuff so there you have it um, I'm gonna go head back out to the beach tomorrow hopefully I can find some more gold to show you hopefully the uh, the wind direction everything's right so all this stuff was found in the water and I don't hunt the dry sand so the water is the place to be to find the gold so see you next time